If you're alternating dumbbell gorilla row, we're going to use a box and place the dumbbells in a neutral position on top of them. For the reason of when you use kettlebells for your gorilla row, we start off in a low position because the kettlebells are on the ground, so they're just accommodating that space. But also, by having the dumbbells on the box, when the hand is resting, or you still hold on to the dumbbell and keep on the box like so, whilst creating rotation in the opposite side. So, dumbbells in a neutral position, we're going to hinge and squat over, the dumbbells like so, in a wide stance, in that gorilla position, hold on to both dumbbells, but then we alternate in the rows, okay? So for first of all, we're going to pull the right elbow to the hip like so. As you can see, the left hand is still holding that dumbbell, right elbow to hip, Slight rotation to the right, back down, change over. Left hand now, elbow to hip, rip cage will take to the left, right hand to the dumbbell, rest on the box. Again, pull, pull and rotate, pull and rotate. Whilst holding, that stand to the legs, hamstrings should be loaded, quads loaded, glutes loaded, chest up with a nice straight back, pull and row. Pull and row. Again, rotating to the side that you're rowing on. Once you've completed the design on the reps, rest and relax.